In the scrub land around where we're staying, there's lots of bugs, insects, slugs, snails and spiders and other bugs. We're looking for signs of animals and straight away you see some rabbit poo here next to a little rabbit hole. And then, very excitingly, over here, um, the badger has done some poos and look at the path it's made. This gives us a very good clue where to put the trail cam tonight to try and get some footage of it. We're off adventuring into the woods. We're heading into Parkgate Down Nature Reserve right next door. We've just come into Parkgate Down Nature Reserve and immediately in this chalk pit we saw lots of rabbits and look how hard they have to dig to make their burrows in the chalk look at all these stones they have to dig out this is chalk grassland and it's a big variety of plants and grass and it's probably never been ploughed and always been used as grazing land. It's getting dusky now and all we can see is the slugs and crickets. Here's a cricket, oh, and another. And look at all these slugs. They're loads of different shapes, sizes and colours. Fungi will grow anywhere, even in poo. There's lots of these little holes along here. Wonder what it is? Mouse or vole? Let's check the trail cam. Um, no badger tonight. Try tomorrow. After harvest, there would have been lots of bits dropped and these birds are taking full advantage of it. This pheasant would have been eating the grain as well. Um, we're going out for a walk tonight again, but we're in the middle of Storm Francis, and you need to be careful in storms. As it's been raining, raining the paths and fields are muddy, which is great for spotting traps of where animals have been. Oh, look, some dog footprints. Oh, definitely human. Oh, some horse footprints. And here's another sign. Poo! Heading into the woods. Now we're in the woods. The wind has calmed down and we're surrounded by evergreen trees that grow straight up and have straight trunks. And look how tall they grow. Ferns, um, unlike most plants, they don't produce fruit, seeds or flowers, but they produce a type of dust called spores, and that goes around and plants new ferns, and they're also very good shelter for birds and small mammals. These ants are big, they're about a centimetre long. And can you see the ones dragging food back to their nest? I think it's going to be a wild night. This is a door beetle. It loves fungi, rotting wood and even poo. We've put the camera out three nights running and nothing. Hopefully tonight as our last night we get some badger action. 
and we figured that it's been up there because of the poo. We didn't get Mr Badger, but we did get the little fellow that lives in this little house. Can you see him? Right in the middle of the screen. We think it's a field mouse. He's having good feed. Oh, there's two of them jumping around. We had an awesome time up here in Kent. Bye from Nature Tastic and bye.